In the beginning, there was nothing. There was nothing. All was darkness. All was Say. darkness. Say. There was nothing at all. There was nothing Only the mother. Only the mother. Only the mother. She was a Luna. She was pure thought without form. She was pure thought. She began to think. She began to think. The mother conceived the world in the darkness. The mother conceived the world in the darkness. She conceived us as ideas, as, as we ideas. think out a house before we begin to make it as real. We think out a house before we begin to make it real. She spun the thread. She spun the thread, spinning us, spun all, the thread. In spinning us all in the story, creating us, creating us in thought. Creating us in thought. And then came the light, and then and the world was real. Came and then light. came the light, and the world, and the world was real. I first met Shibalato when he was 50. I was 48. He's 70 now. Around 20,000 Kogi live here, the heartland. They have no wheel, no writing, and do not welcome strangers. They believe their job is to take care of the world. Shibalata is called a mama. It means enlightened. He's training his daughter, who uses the name Francisca. The mamas said they wanted to work with me because the world is sick and dying, and we have to understand that. They decided to abandon centuries of caution and warn us. 
I came to the Sierra Nevada in 1988, Alan Herrera working for the BBC. The mummers said they wanted to send out a message. I'm here, we all are here, to give a warning. The animals die, the trees dry up, people become ill. Many new illnesses will appear, there will be no cure or medicine for them. They say that we mutilate the world because we do not remember the Great Mother. That unless we do something, the world is coming to an end. He has destroyed so much, but you see, no. Understand? No. Start to understand, or what will happen? Right, that's it. Then they waited, watched, and listened to nature. A major earthquake hit Japan Severe Friday afternoon, causing widespread devastation. Predicts searing droughts, epic floods. My sheep, Kagaba is walking, Mr. Kagaba. I'd stayed in touch for 20 years, but not been summoned before. In the meantime, I'd retired. I had no BBC helicopter, and a coggy had learned to use a camera. They wanted to show our scientists the way nature interconnects, so together we constructed a plan. Hello? Oh, hello. This is Alan Herrera. Yes, hello there. I'm phoning to confirm our order for three. Right, OK. Um, where would you want it delivered to? Um, this is something I need to discuss with the Indians. Um, yes. There is a real possibility that they may come to you to collect it.
call this the civilized world. It's a sort of joke. Here they have no address, no documents, no identity. They speak no Spanish, have no signatures. For them, shoes would break the connection between humans and the earth. Without shoes, you're not allowed to board a plane. going to need 400 kilometers of gold thread. 400 kilometers, yes. Okay, fair enough. Is that a fairly precise amount? Uh, it's a, there's no way of being really precise about it, is there? I think the question is, how long is a piece of string? Do come through and let me show you the machine that's made this gold thread, which I've made for you here. Now, the thread is made by pushing a core yarn through a pipe here, and the wire laps around it, and it runs onto a reel at the bottom here. Um. Haba, Gutchuk, Kasak, and he, she, Kabuashanga, Hadas Ranguanga, Hadashokuanga, Nibun Kajani, Shibaksak Shagunanani, Nukane, M. Shizangaka, Amma Aksha, Wakushin Lakana, Nanki, Kiga Hoja Kanja. It all seems so obvious to them. Places are linked by a black thread of invisible thought. Gold is linked to a luna, it never decays. But what's that to us? We arranged a meeting with a world-renowned astronomer to see if the coggy picture of the universe can make sense as science. I'd like to begin by asking the Kogi view of the world, how large it is and its form. Their picture of the universe is never going to be yours. No, because I have seen things that they couldn't possibly imagine. But then what you talk about are things that the rest of the normal human race can't imagine. It's you? not that complicated. <laughs> well, I hear the words dark energy. Ah, well, dark energy is a recent discovery. When you say dark energy, what are you talking about? It's a property probably of space that we haven't yet understood um, that makes the universe accelerate. And uh, it's a uh, mystery at the moment. Uh, but it fills all space? It fills all space. It could take another hundred years before we really finally understand what's going on. 
iku kagune ay hay kaga akwa ma we iku kagune amma hay hata ni tain ka saka zumaya amma iku kana nasun hay esama hata ni kwa ku ci wa kama ga tsha zumaya amma chek iniki aguna zega and these nodes are intersections with the material world and the darkness is that right i'm trying to understand whether the kogi can grasp the idea of learning something new from an instrument like a telescope um, the concept of discovery i think that their notion of acquiring knowledge is the opposite of ours i think our notion is that each generation knows more than the one before Mm. And theirs is that each generation knows less than the one before. No, some reason I can't. She knows it to me. I just seen a chapana. It tongue was on the Nahil Nakahikine. Tongue was on the Saka Eka. I make a tava hand waggy tongue. I was on the Nugne Chinlakana Hanki Nahiki Hikin Koi. Em. Nay, I'll not get Tom Hanna Haney a key hat a hay chip here and a barn in a quad hay, a lunage. A key name. My key name is Angus, I told was on the here he is in London learning completely new things that he couldn't possibly have imagined in his village. Um, most people would say that experience changes you, um, you know, maybe irreversibly. But I don't get that impression looking at the mama. I, I get the impression that he has a vision and his purpose is to tell us that vision. And that's why he's here. What we see through the telescope, so this is a picture of a small part of the sky and what we see there's lots of systems of stars that we couldn't see without the telescope. And then let's see him. Thank you. That's a star, yeah. That's, that's one, that is one star by itself. And he, Mama, says, Mama has found the one star in this, a single isolated star in this picture straight away. That's right. Mm -hmm. But we cannot see it. Why couldn't we learn from them? set out to trace a black line along the shore, joining specific sites by the mouths of the rivers. These, they say, connect directly with locations on the mountain and are where they used to do their work before the modern world took over and changed things. Okay. 
Enuk, Nechu, Haba, Hate, Hate. The sites may have been destroyed, but that's the point of the journey. The gold thread will be laid. The hidden line will be revealed. Eswama means place of authority. The Kogi believe that's how nature operates. Eswamas in the mountain have direct linkage to places on the shore. The Kogi told me before about token objects they exchange between the mountain and the shore, but I'd thought this was symbolic. Mixing the burned, crushed shells with water produces lime. That makes a paste in their mouths that Kogi men say connects them to the source of life. That paste is rubbed off the stick onto the top of the sugi.
Why they want younger brother to see this? What is the point? What do you think younger brother will... How will this change younger brother? Does, I don't understand. I just can't see that what happens to one specific site is echoed in another miles away. But the mummers say understanding that is the key to healing the world. Dr. Camilo, you have been working as a doctor in the Sierra for many years. You have got to know the Kogi very well. You've learned a good deal about uh, them, I think. Desde hace unos 35 años. Are there things that you have seen a mama or mamas do that you have thought only a mama could do that? Sí. Por ejemplo, hay un ejemplo que es eh, la cuenca del río Huachaca, que fue una cuenca que fue deforestada por los cultivos ilícitos, después la ganadería se acabó prácticamente, hasta que se las entregaron al cuidado de los indígenas. Y no hace mucho, eso hace 20 años. Hoy en día, Caminar uno en esa cuenca es una cosa completamente diferente a como era en ese entonces, que eran potreros, los ríos secándose. Hoy en día son bosques, animales otra vez hay en cantidad, el agua. Son cosas sorprendentes. El problema es que no son consecuencias inmediatas. Jacinto, what is the plan for today's filming? What do you want to do? Si vamos allá en ese sitio, los mamos van a estar conectados con la parte, con los sitios sagrados de la parte alta. I'm sure all this is very interesting for you. I thought that we were making a, a we were trying, the Kogi wanted to explain that the world is dying because of our actions, and they wanted to make this plain and clear at certain sites along the black line. So far, I have seen nothing to indicate that the world is suffering or the world is dying. I have seen nothing to indicate that what happens at these places on the black line has anything to do with the health of the world. Entonces, de pronto, ahora, yo les voy a decir a ellos que, que cada uno ponga sus yatcos para consultar, porque esa es la acción que tenemos que demostrar que sí, en verdad, tenemos conexión con la naturaleza. I agree that it would be a good idea for the mamas to consult and think more about what they're doing and consider how they communicate with us because they need to show to us that they actually do have something to say. To show that places on the coast are connected to places higher up and directly affect them, we really have to go up the mountain and see the connection. The lakes that are found the high, that in the are found high in the mountains are linked to the sea. Bubbles, appear in, bubbles the appear in the water, and the bubbles make the connection.
That is how we communicate with the lakes and the sea and with the mother. The waters speak. The waters speak. I'm sorry, but the bubbles don't speak to us. We have to see the connection with this one. Asinto, KI. What is our first possible date for going up the mountain? Y entonces, última hora, eh, vimos algunos grupos ilegales en la tierra donde va de Santa Marta. Y ya saben que van a subir unos grupos de gente extranjero. Entonces, es muy peligroso para nosotros. Right, obviously we must cancel. We can't, we can't take the risk of going anywhere dangerous. How long will it take him to get up there, find things out, come back down again? We dare not fly up the mountain even though we have a helicopter for the day. <laughs> The indigenous tribes are so alarmed that they walked for days from communities on the world's highest coastal mountain to reach this site on the shore. Developers have dug a trench to drain the lagoons here, mangrove swamps teeming with life. The construction company says that building a port here is necessary for Colombia's growing mining industry and will create 5,000 new jobs. Es un plano del esquema de ordenamiento territorial del municipio de Ulla. El sitio que ellos llaman Jucurba está a 12 kilómetros del occidente de esta línea. Aquí no existen 
zonas de pagamento, no existen comunidades indígenas. Eh, usted que, que, que no conoce, usted que no conoce, nosotros somos buenos, estamos reclamando. ¿Y qué hace Bueno, bueno. De años, no, de 500 años por allá. Yo lo respeto, lo respeto inmensamente. ¿Por qué estamos acá? Well, it's a beautiful day down here on the coast of Colombia, and behind me, there's the snow visible on the mountain peaks of the Sierra Nevada. And it seems that the gorillas have melted away like snowmen. The army is saying that they'll fly us up. The only problem is, this is the third day we've been waiting for the army helicopter because the weather has been lousy. So, our schedule's fallen apart. We're not at all sure what we're doing or how we continue. We hope that a helicopter is going to turn up today. It looks very good here, but apparently the weather where the helicopter is taking off from isn't so good. So, we'll see what happens. With nothing else to do, the mamas have time for a Caribbean beach party. So consult the bubbles.
נין, אין. הוא רצה תשכחה. איינה. הקה הציבה זה הקה הוא לא נקי הקה. מקוי ומקוי. ואין גאה, הוכה תוקוי, הוכה זה הוכה גונן. נקי. אהה. אבל זה הכל תוקה, שראים זה היצה הבא. Mamas have restored the forest upriver, but at the estuaries, professionals are in charge. Aman, I would like you to explain to the mama what your view is of damage to the river estuaries. I am a biologist, and all my life I work with fish and water. The rivers are like a unit, but it's a unit that flows, that moves. But it moves in a direction. And there are certain effects that are very clear, from below to below. pero hay otros que son mucho menos claros de abajo arriba. ¿Por qué? Porque no hay ninguna circunstancia que traslade ese efecto hacia arriba. El efecto hacia abajo es lógico, lo traslada el agua. Entonces, muchas cosas, como la erosión, la deforestación, las partes altas, tienen efecto sobre las partes bajas. Pero lo contrario no es muy evidente. Es más, no es evidente desde ningún punto de vista. ‫הכי <אח> La conexión de las lagunas de arriba a las de abajo es obvia. El agua corre hacia abajo y el agua lleva cosas. Pero, ¿qué lleva las cosas de vuelta de las lagunas de abajo a las de arriba? ニハンデゼゴハミハンチニハンキハイフヤドッカミハンデゼニハンキニハイアデントンカキミハンデジニニザビハトチャハイハバキジョッカフヤハワシェンタアブジェバカアブジェガツイジョゲンハイハイニハ
Kafiri was with them, I got for the Zama. Which a massy kinas and I could do by Jan his and Gahans and Gahana kit to sign up. I had like with a chuck. Music of a judge of the sack is a music of a hymn. A shinanagin. I say joy. I hence a hecka. Me boy. Zadjimai. Hey, hey, Shanuka. Hey, hey, Shanuka. Che Sankada. In Nukana, the Chicka. I so far back way. Ava Nusuni. At the Deva Valencia, Ava Nusuni Narda. I knew Chihaba. And years Hangus, when can I hang? May I need her ain't name? Hatten you are so, huh? You can go on. When you come on, ya hang, hang it at Lusani, hang it. Hainan at Lusani, and Lusani, Hainan. As the ascension, hang, ascension is on a neck. Ascension, hang, cannon, good jerk. Ya, but you hear not. Any hang, cannon. What you hate, ya? I don't know what to do. 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 I When he and Nazi will look at Kaitua, a squadron of Kalkane, he and Nazi Sinazi Kana in a Nazi. I take it to Nazi. When any Kagan made this a key, he might be quite to Hakina was a tunaze. I have a I I may have got it to last year. I have to do lasha. Nigni Hazika Nuxuza Ulda Hainas Gikuka Hade Hanin Kahana Husku Hage Ehage Saki Amy Gaviakun Laki 
ai zo qabla tsira na uni hubale ti mawole mi gwiak ave nuqa maqudira ki huzi mayate kwaba mi gwiapana shqagakwe eni magaza hecha gwapane khan ai zo luna muleto kwaba mi gwaina khasa hwa bazthana ai nu kha ijig zitu azhaita wakwa ai khazhaita makochiga ganu kha uni zitu guchiga kai guino ichengsha shibala manaku sha guin wakwa uni zitu wasunze Ikimi khalege togechi ga kwa aitu ni jawa jawa zana na miga hongo jini ni ainga ma ho khadira ya na dagale sai mon teze ga chigarna ni kha miya miya tune na zaka ainna ho Katoni ma hulok sha gwe khanki sai kugwa sa khanga ba su su mimi ga khongo jini ki miya wati eni ma ba ai ki mi khalaishi eni jau shinga maga za khaicha go to go chigarna ya ga koichi ga ko isabi ma ko jira ya ga tiya na wa ja wa eni ko ga jin ka ma ko jini jini na ho da ji maga za khaicha go to ga Eni jini ai hubale din na gaza khaicha go gale na le eni jini a khaita wa la charge na kanuze maninga ni stunku na le gaki uba abu chigabanga uba na ji shanu kha na wo chiga ai ki go to go chiga a chaganu kha mama hai nay tay nu qat hun go ju gay na le in ki hi ki ga tsay nay ngwe ga e khan nan qapana chi ga sa ki ji ni in ki maqa ko nay u bang na kan na le ni well this is the third night of our two-day visit to the Siswama. We're not quite sure why we're still here. We needed to move on, and to do that, we needed mules and a helicopter. Mules to carry food and baggage and a helicopter to carry the camera equipment. We got the mules. We didn't get the helicopter, and we don't know why. We have satellite phones, but they're not really working. All that we can do is receive text messages. Why does your phone say it's 1728? Have you noticed that? And so far, we have had two. We believe they come from somewhere in the 21st century, but they are a bit mysterious. We got a text message this morning which said that the helicopter was about to take off. That was at 8.30 this morning. We waited, and we're still waiting. We'll see what happens tomorrow. Nabulo, 
Muretto che ha avuto i giorni, non sono come il suo Ma sei matto? Sei matto. Sei matto. E niente, e niente. A Kanga, e niente, e niente. A Kuhangu, a Nashasha. A Chipana, Panangomine, e chi? Zai Garnu. The Kogi say that damage at the bottom of the rivers, at the river mouths, affects the system up here. Do you believe that? No, creo, sé, porque todo lo que puedes hacer a un ecosistema arriba, arriba afecta el funcionamiento de abajo y lo que funciona abajo también como están actuando afecta el funcionamiento de arriba. En este lago está cambiando la vegetación, han sembrado eh, especies de, de otros países, eucaliptos, cipreses alrededor de la laguna. Esta vegetación evapora rápidamente el agua y afecta y compite con las especies de niebla. Estas nubes que llegan de las verdientes enfrían el agua y la condensan y escurre por los troncos y se acumulan en las rocas. Estas rocas son rocas madre, rocas de arenas que acumulan el agua como una esponja y sueltan esa agua abajo en las vertientes. Vemos que no solamente los ríos son, son, son entes muertos, son entes que están relacionándose con la fauna, con las aves, todo el proceso de dispersión de semillas, por ejemplo, 
se da de arriba abajo y de abajo arriba. También eh, todo el tema de algunas especies que no sabemos por qué se encuentran arriba, eh, como por ejemplo peces en las zonas de lagunas. Muchas veces eh, se ha visto por trabajos que están asociados a migraciones de aves que llevan huevos de, de pescados en sus alas. Es por eso que en muchos países, por ejemplo como España, estas teorías han cambiado la forma de funcionar, especialmente eh, se están desarrollando trabajos para descanalizar los ríos que han sido canalizados en las partes bajas para mejorar el funcionamiento de los acuíferos en las partes altas. beginning to fit together and we'd had some good news. A world leader in marine biology had actually arrived on the coast to look at the sites and meet the mummers. Well, one of the things that I'm very interested in is, is the way in which the Cody view uh, the natural world. No, Kaiga. Ni. Ni a gatse. Aviakaina de Jirka. The Kogi talk in quite a mystical way about the connections between the sea, the rivers, the lakes, the land. I can't see how that makes sense to a scientist. Well, it makes a huge amount of sense, particularly here in, uh, on, the, on the northern coast of Colombia. The Kogi talk about threads between these systems. Effectively, those systems really are very strongly connected. All, of, all along this coast, the development has disrupted the flow of water from the land towards the sea. And this has caused big problems in the whole area. Because of the very high evaporation caused by the heat, you end up with very large quantities of salt in the ground, which often kills the vegetation. Along this stretch of coastline in Colombia, you almost have in microcosm what is happening elsewhere in the Caribbean and also elsewhere on the planet. Their view that all these activities are really having a serious impact at a larger scale are quite right.
A eso, esta operación hacemos nosotros, andamos guaqueando. Bueno, ya sacamos la olla esta, se le saca la tierra. Así. Enterrada. No, para tomar una prenda esa, ahí es que trabajar por lo menos cuatro, cinco, seis meses para de pronto toparse una prenda esa. Y eso estando muy de buena para toparla. Y si no, no topa nada. Saca por ahí pollitas y otras cosas, pero el oro es trabajoso ya. Pero para ellos sí representa mucho. Porque eso es de los antepasados de ellos. Los legítimos dueños de esas, de esas prendas son ellos. No, es, no, es, no son los particulares. Pero como todo en la vida es trabajo, uno la, la busca para pa poder sobrevivir. No es que llegue y a Marbella que se tuvo la chica con Gakuga y nada, que va a ser, y que ma, ni camarés, ma, 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 goma de Jihi, que va a no, pues yo al mamo le diría que a nosotros pues que nos disculpe. Ay, mi guac, ay, qué guac, a cuáles no que, a canque. Hade, hade, nahi. Hade, cague. Bueno, para mí... La guacamaya andío es por la destrucción de la naturaleza que ya ellas no tienen a dónde sobrevivir, no tienen un paradero para llegar aquí, hay un bosque para llegar donde hayan semillas para ellas comer. Para mí es eso. Yo creo que por el asunto de la guaca no.
Hello, Alan. How are you? Okay, fine. We've just managed to log on to Skype. You can hear us? Yes, we can hear you. And please send my greetings from the Zoological Society of London. No, 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 because we tend to conserve an area without much thought to the special places in a geological time scale. So for species, there are areas that are like a refuge, which through geologic time have been extremely important for them to survive. And on the short term, we may remove these areas and there may be no big effect. But in the long term, through history, the species can't persist when those special zones have disappeared. So in many ways, we're looking for much the same thing, is to understand where exactly these special sites are. We have to better understand connectivity, and right now we have a very basic understanding of how things interact and affect each other. And I believe that this is essential for our future security to understand these special sites, to ensure that they're conserved. Uh, Jonathan, yes. I want to try moving the computer to another location while we continue talking, if that's all right. See if it works any better. Can you hear me all right? I can hear you fine. The connection seems to be holding. And uh, uh, when I turn the computer around, you may be able to see the dolphins leaping, <coughs> um, which are paying attention to this conversation. Well, it's an, it's an important one. It is very extraordinary to hear that these kind of origin sites that the Indians are talking about make sense to you as well. This will come as a surprise, certainly comes as a surprise to me, and I think will come as a surprise to a lot of people. I don't find it such a surprise, really, though. I mean, people living with nature understand a lot more about it, obviously, than a world that has become much uh, and really disconnected from it. Living with nature, you realize that certain species have certain strongholds or certain refuge areas that are essential to them. They're telling us something from their experience, uh, which we should uh, easily recognize, but for some reason we find it very difficult. And I think it's very important to have that message. And, and uh, they're the ones that are going to know these, uh, these particular areas in the forest that will be important for the long-term survival of species. So I think we have much to learn from them. final estuary, the final place to lay the thread, Cienega Grande, the Great Lagoon. between different parts of 
this ecosystem. Okay. Casa Kajin Shulama Shi Se Kajin is in Kawasha Gun. Gunene Kega Haba Hai Tur Nakoch Hanate Nogana Kega Ziu Hai Tur Nagunkal. Gold does not, does not decay. decay. Eswamas were, were dressed in gold. Now it is wealth. Now it is wealth. Now it is wealth and, has and has all been plundered. This was the material bridge to life, vitalizing the water. The Aswamas are stripped. The water dries out. The water dries out. How will we live? How will we live? I thought the journey was over. But now the mummers took over the filming, simply saying that without hope, all this would be pointless. <laughs> I thought this was the mummer's journey, and I would film what happened to them. But in fact, they were taking me on a journey. 
they see a possibility of hope if we listen. Thank you. 